Hey guys, and welcome back to COD Wins, and today we're going to be talking about Drake from the Inquisitor Master Squad, because guys, we know where he went. But before we begin with today's video, I want all of you to hit that red subscribe button as well as the notification bell, that way you never miss out on a single video from us in the future. So without further ado, let's jump right in. As you probably know, back in January of 2021, Drake used to appear in almost every video of Inquisitor Master. It seemed like he was one of the main members. Things changed when he suddenly stopped appearing. At first, fans thought that he was busy for a video or two, but as time went by, they started to realize he wasn't gonna come back. As you probably know, just a few days ago, Zack uploaded a video which gained a lot of attention. The video is titled Drake Returns to the Squad, and the thumbnail clearly shows that Drake is supposedly back. So is he? Well, if you haven't seen the video, yes he is. But that's not what we're here for. We need to answer the question about what happened to him, and that's what we're going to do now. So to understand why Drake disappeared from videos, we need to talk about the atmosphere in the Inquisitor Master Squad. Throughout the months, many rumors about Alex being supposedly abusive to her squad members have been spreading. A lot of people believed, and still believe, that Alex isn't treating her friends right. But why? Well, as you know, Inquisitor Master's really money hungry, which means she really cares about her money. I mean, really. She loves to spend money and it shows, but what does it have to do with the squad? Well, the squad members are obviously getting paid to do these videos, or are at least supposed to be getting paid. You see, Alex barely pays them, despite claiming she does. It's very annoying for all of them, but because of the fact that they can't really find a better job, they just keep making videos for her in hopes that she will end up paying them. This, of course, angered a lot of squad members, including Drake. He was not happy with how Alex was treating them. So, he decided to take a step back. To be honest, I don't blame him. A lot of people actually believe that he didn't quit but got kicked out, but is there any proof of it? Well, it seems like there might be. A vast number of subscriber celebration cupcakes were baked in the honor of Alex's vlog channel, each adorned with a corresponding member of the squad cookie picture. Drake-themed cupcakes were unfortunately not an option. Many fans were concerned and confused because of this, but it's just the beginning. As you know, on the Inquisitor Master banner, all squad members are usually listed. This includes Sora, Levi, Luca, Zack, Alex, Jay, Jax, Light, and Charlie. But it doesn't include Drake anymore. He was no longer featured in the banner, but when fans heard that he had been there before, everyone was shocked, which led a lot of people to believe that he was removed from the squad. It gets even crazier though. So you might know that Zack created his own squad, which led to a lot of people believing that him and Alex broke up. After all, Zack hasn't been included in the squad videos for quite a while either, and they even removed each other from their channel section on YouTube. Now, honestly, what I'm trying to say is, don't you find it weird that after all this time being missing, Drake suddenly comes back to join Zack's squad? I find it super suspicious. And it could actually mean that if he really did get kicked from the Inquisitor Master Squad, maybe he also had a fight with her. In the end, it seems like everything's chaos in the squad. At this point, we can only speculate as to why Zack formed his own team and why Drake did not rejoin Alex's squad, as he instead became a member of Zack's group. Everything right now is so hectic, but at the end of the day, I'm so thankful to see Drake again, it's wonderful to have him return after being missing for so long. But that's all we have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit the like button if you did, and don't forget to subscribe with post notifications on so that you never miss out on a single video from us in the future. Until we see you guys next time, take care and watch the two videos that are on your screen. Bye now!